Don't get mad with the person in your life. They didn't pick you. You pick them. You, you pick them because you were out of your mind. And when you were out of your mind, you were searching for your kind. You found them when you found him or her. And now that you're with them, you start to experience these other kinds of pains. Because now that you've connected on a level of pain, you are now reintroduced to what hurt you. It wasn't them, but the feelings they give you resemble them. And those are the feelings that you've been walking around with and you've never healed them. And so that's why they're so familiar and comfortable. It isn't because they love you, it's that they remind you. So you are reminded of the only kind of affection and feeling that you're familiar with. You're not familiar with love. You're familiar with pain. And so you use love as an escape. So love or relationship is your methadone clinic. It's a synthetic. And you need that because you're out of your mind. So what you're choosing in the condition is a representation of what has not been resolved. And so unless and until we go back and back as far as we need to, to understand where those emotions come from, then that becomes our alcohol. We get drunk on it every single day day because I've always said a drug addict is not addicted to drugs a drug addict is addicted to pain they use drug to medicate the pain that's why they call it drug abuse because in the use it turns into abuse the abuse is because your tolerance level was here when you started you could get high here. Over time, that don't work. So you have to abuse the drug or take up the dose so that it can do what it used to do. So the one you have now is just a reflection of your need to increase the dosage. But he's the same person. It's just double the dose. You see how pain has to be fed with what medicates it. Because the person who's otherwise not going to be a reflection of your pain is not going to accept your behavior. Mm. Say the word. Say the word.